Are you still not even really leveling up? You're still at that lowest version of yourself, bro, because you fully haven't detached from the corn. You know what I'm saying? You fully haven't detached from it, bro. And that's one thing that a lot fucking force why a lot of people need to understand, bro. If you're on this journey, bro, you gotta be clean with it, bro. You can't do no peeking. You can't be looking at it. You can't be falling for that instant gratification, bro. You gotta be really locked in mentally to not even wanna watch those things. I and mean, you gonna think about it, because we're men, especially if you work out, you gonna get horny. You know what I'm saying? If you full of energy, full of life, it's gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? It might be when you first wake up, might be in the middle of your workout. It might be when you just not even want to think about it, but it pops up. But eventually it's gonna happen, bro. But you cannot, you can't be weak in the mind and realize and say, hey, I'ma just go watch 30 seconds, five minutes. I'ma get it. No, you can't do that, bro. You gotta hold yourself accountable on a lot of these things, man. And that's really being one of them, bro. Not peeking, not watching, not looking. Because not only is it hurting you, bro, it's hurting your partner. It's gonna hurt your friends, your coworkers. You might come to work and that's they drained as hell because you want to look at it all down big type shit. But yeah, that's that's what this is gonna be about, man. Just not peeking, bro. Just being tunnel vision, having full fucking focus on whatever you got going on. And not falling for the instant gratification, bro. Yeah, man, that's just that's something that we all we all gotta work on, it, bro. I do, cause I ain't perfect type shit. You know what I'm saying? And that's one thing I'm really trying to work on. It's not peeking, not going, not searching, not going to look for it type shit. If you get on, just putting hella pain and working out. Cause I've been working out for like what's this, ten days now. 10 days straight type shit. Still going strong. Like I said, we're going live again tonight. But again, doing some pull-ups. Yeah. I'm working on it though. I'm getting better. This journey, I haven't folded. But it do be some days like this morning. It was very tempting, but I couldn't do it, bro. Because I know where that shit could lead to. You know what I'm saying? I know that that shit will fuck with me mentally. And... I gotta be honest with myself at the end of the day type shit, you know? But yeah, it do be tempting, but you can't peek at it, bro. Yeah, you gotta be honest with you, honest with yourself, honest with that man in the mirror, and realize that whatever you say you're gonna do, bro, do it. Hold yourself accountable type shit. Don't be edging, bro. Don't be edging to the shit. Like, that shit is not fucking cool. Like, my, bro, go meet you a real fucking girl and do that shit with her. Don't fucking do that shit with yourself, weird motherfucker. Like, don't do that shit. But yeah. I'm about to get back into this workout though, but I had to make this quick little segment because that's what I really want to speak on this morning. Like, that shit was tempting, bro, but I just couldn't type shit, you know what I'm saying? One to 13, one push up, two, three, four, all over to 13 type shit. Yeah, that's definitely what we're gonna do. Alive again. I made me some. I'm gonna give me some eggs, some baked beans, some turkey sausage, probably some oatmeal. Let's get my, let's go get my breakfast type shit. But yeah, don't peek. Don't look at this shit. Try not to think about it. And if you do think about it, bro, go put that pain and working out and putting in reps, bro. Go put that pain into reading a reading a book, meditating, guitar sessions, painting. Going outside, getting in nature. You know what I'm saying? If you do get an urge, go outside, bro. Like, just go outside. Go to a park. Go stand in your yard. Go sit outside. Sit in the grass. Grab a chair. Do something, bro. Type of shit. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah. I'm 30 years old. Trained my whole life. on to fight my cocaine addiction. Hope someone younger reads this and never, ever start doing drugs. Nah, man. Don't do drugs, man. Don't do drugs, man. Stay away from the drugs, bro. That cocaine, that shit heavy. That's a heavy ass job, my brother. I hope you get through your shit, though. I hope you get through your addiction, man. But that's something that, yeah, don't do not do drugs, man. I, don't do, I, I lost a couple of people to drugs, and it's not. That shit ain't fun, bro. I done seen people the whole had a whole life ahead. You know what I'm saying? And 
it all come down just 